Bucky, have you actually put rolls to the right one? Or is this someone's house? Hmm. Bucky. <laughs> <laughs> this is it. Bucky. <laughs> this is someone's garden, Bucky. <laughs> <laughs> Is, is this a, uh, hotel? a hotel? You made yeah. Oh yeah. What? <laughs> what? So you understood what she said? No. I said I'm coming down with the axe. It, it, it says that. It says there on the front. So <laughs> it's right. I told you. <laughs> yeah, I've just been over to the sign. That's what I'm saying. I told you because the sign says it. I can hear bats over there. Yeah. Transylvania. There's literally. It's literally. There's tons and tons of bat caves around here really yeah that's why that was kind of like the thing the myth it's not a myth bro it's true yeah it's not a myth it's all true it's all fucking true oh, two rounds awesome. no, well, I guess we have our own perfect thank you oh we can it bro you guys can say way yeah um, wait wait 12 uh, no 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 this one this one yeah perfect Get a translator. Google Get Google. Google translation. Okay, excuse me. I got it. <laughs> oh, modern technology. <laughs> okay. Uh, how much was it? Yeah, thirty euro. So twenty-six pound. So what's that in? Uh, you have to convert it. Yeah, hundred and forty. Hundred and forty, Lee. Okay. 140 Lee. Mm -hmm. Me and Bucky are heading out into Bran, which is the home of Dracula's castle. Oh. And there's cats everywhere. And we're going out to find something sweet. We had an Italian tonight, but we've got a bit of a sweet tooth tonight. So we thought, what have they got in Transylvania to eat? Now, I saw Cordy eating a waffle this morning. And I've wanted a waffle ever since. So I'm hoping to find a waffle shop or like an Italian dessert place that has waffles. If not, I'll settle for a lion bar at a news agent's. Do they have lion bars over here? Uh, I don't know. Or a Kit Kat. I'll settle for a Kit Kat. But sure. I want something nice and warm. Bucky's driving, so I've had a beer. I've had a beer. And it's a no tolerance alcohol, zero limit here. So you can't have alcohol at all. Yeah. I'm gonna say bye to our accommodation for tonight. Josh and Cody are in that room. It looks like they're dancing at the window. I don't know what those guys are doing. There's Dracula's castle literally a minute away from our accommodation. Look at that, right in front of us. It's literally right next to where we're staying. And um, we're going in tomorrow, we're doing the secret tunnels. So not many people know this, but the secret tunnels that go underneath Brand Castle. And tomorrow, we explore the tunnels. And not only that, we are doing an overnight stay in Dracula's Castle. Um, they said to us, they've got no beds, so there's no sleeping. I was like, you know what? I ain't gonna sleep in that place. I got a feeling no one's gonna sleep. This is Transylvania at night. A lot of it's pretty much dead. There's still some bars and stuff open. I'm looking for some kind of sweet shot. I'm not sure if this is open. I saw someone in the window. No, I don't think it's open. No, she's cleaning up. There's a cat there. Look at these two dogs asleep. Poor oh, things. You know? Yeah. Right now, I'm picking up a couple of bags of chips. And I'm thinking about buying this. This looks really good. It's like caramel wafers, yeah. They look really good. I'm going to buy a few different bits and we'll try them. So I just bought, I'm buying a cigar. I've never smoked a cigarette in my life. Right, so we just bought some magnets. We bought some sweets and treats. And I bought a cigar. I don't even know why I bought a cigar. I bought a cigar. I've never smoked a cigarette in my life and I've just I've just bought a cigar Bucky what the hell is Transylvania doing to me Bucky went with the uh, home favorite Pringles we've got this one at home right Texas barbecue mm. why are you going for something new and different Bucky doesn't like to be taken out of his comfort zone you see he likes what he knows and he knows what he likes <laughs> what is that you ask <laughs> it's the head of our lads your boy has brought back the bacon. 
<laughs> the heck? <laughs> Did you need all that? I bought I bought a cigar and I don't know why. It is cold. You just wanted to. And you yeah. bought what? what is oh, I bought some chocolate. You, you, you too cold. I'm not cold. Now, I didn't know. I didn't know what Chris you want. Uh, oh, I perfect! I wanted these ones. Oh, that's cool. I bought you two bags. These ones looked amazing. I love caramel. Like proper caramel, and these look like just caramel wafers. Wow. No taste at all. I don't even taste anything. I don't know what it is. It's not even. It's like I'm, I'm just eating air. And the <laughs> aftertaste is killing me right now. <laughs> oh my god, it's like you're eating a tree. Yeah. You take a piece of a tree. I'm spitting this out. They're <laughs> <laughs> not good. Yeah, that's. They make things look really good, but they're really not. Okay, so these stood out to me on the shelf. These look amazing. Yeah, Josh, take one in. I think it's like. Yeah, it's just chocolate filled. Like biscuit. How is that? Well, really weird. Really. It has like this caramel taste and then a vanilla taste and then back to chocolate all in one bite. Okay. Try it. It's weird. It's not that good. <laughs> it's got, yeah, weird taste with it. Yeah, like a, like a caramel taste, right? So right now, we are heading to the infamous Bran Castle. There it is in the distance, shadowing the little village of Bran. Well, I'm not sure if I actually told anyone last night on the video, but I lost the drone. I crashed the drone on some trees in the mountain. So we're going to go and try and rescue the drone right now. So right now we're inside Dracula's castle. This is going to be a daytime tour. So we're coming here during the day, but we also are staying overnight. So it seems like a lot of places are blocked off, you're not allowed. Definitely. Seems like they're really stepping it up for Halloween. You've got a lot of pumpkins about and cobwebs. And I'm not sure how I quite feel about it all. I think it just feels very... I don't know. I mean, they're trying to keep this very authentic and stuff, but yet they're putting all these fake cobwebs over. Yeah, it adds to the feel a little bit, but still. I'm not quite sure how I feel about it. Oh, this takes us. See you later, Bucky. Why am I not doing this at Halloween already? That is a cool... What? What did you say? It's a Christmas tree. That's not a Christmas tree. Why is it? It's a Halloween tree. Halloween. Yeah, it's a Christmas tree that they've left died and then turned for Halloween. No, it's just a, it's a Halloween tree. Plain and simple. You've got the autumn leaves, you've got the cobwebs, you've got other autumn artifacts, pumpkins, skulls, candles. It's a full-blown Halloween tree and I'm going to start doing that every year. We are now going higher into the castle. It's locked. So I think these 
these latches here with the cannons because they overlook kind of like the, the little village perfect place for shooting invaders well apparently this was like a fortified fort suits of armour over there and the weapons I just hate all this rope it's just really annoying This is the torture chamber. Yeah. Look at that thing. I'm sure you used to call that the Iron Maiden. Oh well in the UK I think they call it the Iron Maiden. Uh -huh. I imagine being put inside that and being impaled. Slowly bleeding mm -hmm. until you die. And there's something else there as well. Uh -huh. no, no. Some stocks. A bunch of people over there taking pictures in here. For some reason, red barrier here, but we've ended up inside. I don't know how. So get back, peasant. Right. So, Cody, I'm not too. I'm not too sure how comfortable I feel. You're riding around the rest of Romania Dude. with with uh, an old flint. Gun. I'm the one who's going to be saving us from the vampires. True. With that's a good bullets. point. You could buy that's silver bullets. Silver bullets. Silver silver bullets. That's Dude. werewolves, though, isn't it? Dude, and vampires. Really? I thought we got to coat it with like uh, garlic oil and put a cross in it. I will. I'll put okay. a little cross. <laughs> I'll go to the <laughs> garlic. The whole nine yards. Yeah, you probably want that one. Looks so you cool. got to drink out of time. It's the most dracula. I mean, this is cool too, but I don't know. This is where we drink blood from. Yeah, you've got to. It's, it's customary. Yeah. So that's us finished in Brown Castle. I've actually just bought a poster, and I bought my parents some Dracula coffee, because apparently all vampires drink coffee. So we've just been through the castle. It is absolutely amazing, but it's very touristy during the day. They have given us permission to stay overnight. Yes, that's right. We are staying overnight in Dracula's castle. It's a dream come true. But yeah, I bought some really cool things. I'm going to take a look at the village now. The village has so many unique features. And obviously, with Dracula surrounding this place, everything is Dracula themed. I'm going to be skint after this. I'm following the boys on this long track. Yeah. Well, he said to us, if we get locked in, we've got to take the tunnel out. Yup. <laughs> we'll see what happens. We have lanterns. <laughs> <laughs> so, overnight challenge is going to be a separate video. So, make sure you tune in in a couple of days. It is going to be intense. I love all the autumn theme. We've got all the pumpkins just sat around. It's amazing. We've got all the leaves falling. This is my time of year. And I couldn't think of a better way to spend it than at Dracula's Castle. You know as well, I've got to say a big shout out to, to the team as well. Exploring, without exploring with Cody, we wouldn't be doing this overnight challenge. So big shout out to Cody. Maybe. Yeah. No, it's like, you know, Josh always says teamwork makes the dream work. And it's, it's, <laughs> it's so true because without this team now, I wouldn't be here. I would never venture to Romania with just Bucky um, or like any anyone else, to be honest. So, um, yeah, without these guys, you know, I wouldn't be vlogging here. You guys would be watching me here. So, yeah, big shout out to them. So I love the way they emphasise the fact that you could die
by falling in this water by a skeleton hand popping out of the water. Now when I imagined coming to Dracula's castle I had no idea it would be this beautiful but it is just absolutely amazing. <laughs> Good afternoon everyone and it is an exciting day today not only is it nearly Halloween but it is the release of my brand new website www.ewfofficial.com at the moment you can go on and purchase an official EWF merchandise hoodie and Halloween exclusive limited edition only 50 prints available I think there's like 30 odd prints left and if you order before 5 p.m. tomorrow you will be guaranteed to get it before Halloween and make sure you send in a picture because I'll be putting all the pictures on an upcoming video so enjoy the rest of your day everyone and get ready for tomorrow's episode so right now I'm walking around the grounds of Dracula's castle it's there shadowing this part of the gardens but it's absolutely beautiful look at all the just orange leaves I love autumn so much and as you can see there's a lot of tunnels that lead underneath and we're going to see if we can come out of any of these tunnels tonight. Don't forget, it will be an episode in a couple of days, maybe even tomorrow. I'm going to see how fast I can get it all edited and put out. But obviously, I want to get it out before Halloween. Um, with the amount of vlogging I've been doing, I'm going to try my best to do everything in time. Now, this is one of the many gift shops in the castle. And there's obviously a lot of Dracula stuff. But they don't actually have any Dracula wine. They've got a lot of castle wine. But I'm on the search for Dracula's wine. I have found some in the uh, local shop outside. So right now we're exiting the actual castle grounds. And this is like where they would have like uh, peasant shacks. But now they've got little stalls. And they sell all kinds of little trinkets. But I'm looking for, well that kind of stuff actually. Like the, the proper typical Dracula style merchandise. I did Jack of the T-shirts. <laughs> oh, the magnets. Right, so we just ate lunch. Um, I had a really nice burger, cheeseburger with chips and a Coca-Cola, and it was like less than four pounds. Unreal. <laughs> that boy is a bit, a bit stronger. Not to lean on it. So we're now in the. It's kind of like the courtyard of the castle. This is where all the peasants would have been back in the day, selling fruit and veg. <laughs> it's, it's true. I know. In Dracula's lifetime, they started to release the, uh, they just came out with the first printing press. So that's how Dracula's story kind of got bigger, because they, they were able to like exaggerate things about him. So they almost made clickbait titles what about Dracula when it first came out. So you, you could probably see around here like, Maybe not this exact spot, but they would have papers out so you could read all about Dracula and shit. Oh, wait a minute, was that one I bought? I yeah, bought maybe, one. yeah, exactly. I I one of, yeah, we'll have to show that later on yeah, in the video. Exactly. No, no, Bucky, I don't need a new chandelier for the house. Oh, you'll have a lot of Yeah, but it, it, it set fire to the place. Yeah, I totally forgot about that picture we, we bought. That's probably what that was from. Yeah, I can't wait to get that out, actually. That's cool. That's going to go in the room, in the souvenir room. Yeah. I just love these magnets. I'm gonna buy quite a few of these. There's a lot of wind chimes in here. If I give you 100, yeah? I like it. 160? Oh, so much. <laughs> Thank you though. You like your suit, Oh, no. The other one's nice. Big, big okay. bat. Okay. Maybe later. 100 though. 100. Let me know. Josh trying to buy a bat. You need to buy that bat. I need to buy the bat. <laughs> I mean, who else can say they bought a bat from, from Dracula's castle? Dude, I know. This happens to you every time I go out on a trip. Something like this comes up. <laughs> There's always a bat. <laughs> well, something like, like this, we're like, you're in this country, you gotta buy it. We already got the wine, we got the posters, but the bat would really seal the deal. Leave a comment below, should he buy the bat or not? <laughs> Leave a comment now. <laughs> There's hundreds of people now saying yes. Buy the I, I really I feel like it is. In the uh, in the right hand corner, there's gonna be a poll. Should Josh buy the bat? Yes or no? He's, he's gonna have to buy the bat. I think I might. I'm gonna have to count the poll. It might happen. <laughs> the, one of the the, the Brown Castle um, cats. It's a ghost cat. Yes. 
Look at his eyes. I've never seen eyes like this. No, I think the cat's blind. See? You can't see. It has like really scary looking eyes too. I don't think he's blind. I don't know, man. The way it's looking at us. This is tripping me out. Yo. I don't want to go first. I'll go, I'll go first. Josh, you go first. I'm going first, guys. It's really dark. We're all inside together. <laughs> I don't know if something's going to happen. Oh! Sure. I don't know. Are you sure this is the way? <laughs> no, that's not the way. Then where do we go? This way. Oh! What the heck? Yo, it's Frankenstein! You seeing that? I'm seeing this. We have Frankenstein I wasn't oh. ready for this. I just wanna get out. I'm just trying to follow jo Josh's shadow. Yeah, it's really dark in this thing. My orange hat. Something's going on up here. This is the real, this is the real Jacko's castle right now.
I don't know, bro. I was just walking down a dark alleyway, bro. I don't trust this here. Oh, we're out. So I don't know how much of that you actually seen, but that was terrifying. Especially being in like a Transylvanian one. You never know if some guys had a bad day at work and just decided to take things real <laughs> and just slaughter everyone in, inside one of these places. So it'd be a perfect place to do it. I always think about that when I go in places like that. Like a disgruntled worker decided to go all realistic and just slaughter everyone. <laughs> so right now we're walking down the main street in Bran. And I think we're just going to go and chill out now, do some editing and get prepared for tonight because I don't think any of us are ready for what tonight's going to bring. We're not. I might even take a nap. I nearly walked into that line. Huh? I nearly walked into that line. What's that? I'm kind of just blown out. So right now we're just finishing up our time lapses of the castle. And we're gonna crack open the Dracula blood. Dum dum dum. All right, Dan. Do the honors. I'm trying to open it. Come on, boys. Well, you're not even filming this, Josh. So. Doesn't oh, matter. How'd you get in there? What are you guys doing? Opening it up? I'm yeah. Doing you opening it. Oh wait! wait I yeah. want to film it. <laughs> I thought you weren't gonna put it in. I'm gonna put it in, but it's just this is this is a great. Time lapse we got. It's alright, Dan, you can open it. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Come on, Josh. This intro is so good, though. Look at this. Alright, Dan, what do we got? We got a cork. Wait! Start over, I want to be in it. Can we use this with my video, too? Okay, we're in it. So, we got a cork in the bottle, but no corkscrew, so I'm going to attempt to try and open it with this. <laughs> uh, I don't know how successful I'm going to be. Careful. Easy boy. I'm trying. I'm I can't believe I'm holding Dracula's cup though in my hand. No, I don't know if this is gonna work, boys. I don't know if this What if you stab it hard and turn it? Do you think? Is the way you're doing it? It might go in though, it might pop the cork. I suppose if a cork. If it goes in, it's not easy. Okay. Well watch out though. Can you pour anything out? He's pushing further. No. <laughs> stick no. your stick your middle finger in there! <laughs> the problem the problem we've got is when we're pushing the cork down, oh, it's compressing it, yeah. the wine, which is not letting it flow past it. Pass. So I think we messed up with so that. We need a giant stick. No, we can do it. We just gotta to get it out. Oh, I can hear it. It just just needs a bit of a little bit of a. Holy yeah, it's coming out. Yeah, yeah. yeah! We've got some blood. Yeah! Wait, wait, wait. We've got we need blood. Light. We need light for this. I have a light. All right, yeah. You hold it like that. <laughs> <laughs> just check that on camera now. Oh, this is great. So this is the blood of Dracul. Dracul. Dracul, the second son of the <laughs> dragon. So we've been told we've got to drink the blood of Dracul if we want to go in there at night. Yeah. So we show, do show them a close-up of how this bottle looks. Do we have the chalice? Oh. Where's the chalice? Where's, 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 where's the chalice? Where's the chalice? Where you put it? Where's the holy darkness grail? <laughs> Where is it? Okay. Got it. <clears throat> we have it. Look at this, we got the cross. Yo, how red is it? That's I had what I to, want to I had to forge this in 250 degrees Celsius to get this like Show this. it. Yes. Drink. Dude, that is ridiculously red. <laughs> Bro. Oh, it smells oh, like Dracula. It smell good. 
Yeah, it smells like Dracula's blood, it if that smells like, good. It smells like 700 years old. It smells like, yeah, it's aged blood. <laughs> aged blood. This is amazing. <laughs> oh. Cheers. Shall I do the first the first drink? Yeah, because I don't want to die. Dracula's blood. Don't die, so. We'll let you do it first. See what right. Yeah, see if it's poisoned or not. I hope you're you joking. I feel it! <laughs> it no, it's actually quite good. Okay. We all wake up vampires, we're gonna start creating vampire vlogs, which is gonna be a first of its kind, and I'm quite excited about that. But Flying they're only vlogs. gonna be at night. Yeah, night time That's true, night time <laughs> yeah. vlogs. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get a good light. Yeah. Well? I feel it. Oh! I feel it too. You're amping up so much! Definitely. Yeah? The moment we've been waiting for. I mean, we're staring at the castle, we're on the mountain, <laughs> we're looking over the village, the fog's coming in, and we're drinking Dracula's blood, and we're gonna go in there. <laughs> Had some corkscrew in it. Usually <laughs> 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 with corkscrew. <laughs> Take two, boys. Here we go. My God! For Dracula! For Dracula! For Dracula! I want to say a big shout out to Polymill as well. Without Polymill, I wouldn't have been able to open this cork, even though it didn't have a corkscrew. I still use this, and this is an amazing product. Definitely check it out. It's on my seal of approval list. Thank you so much. So as you know, I crashed the drone yesterday. It's been sat there for 24 hours right now. 24 hours, that poor thing's been sat there alone. I mean, it's been having a little bit of a break, but I've got to retrieve it. I'm just wondering how it is not permitted at all to fly drones around here. So it's going to be a struggle. Right there, we can see. Dracul Castle. I'm gonna stay overnight. There is no one here, no tourists, nothing. Just us in a flashlight. This is so cool. This is better than ghost hunters. <laughs> this is real. It's like the Willy Walk on the Chocolate Factory at night. Yeah, you know when no one else is allowed in, they finally get in for the first time. I feel that excited. Yeah, that's that's how I feel. How many people get to actually go here at night and be in Romania in general? This is the Halloween special. Just looking at the castle, hearing the bats. It's such an atmosphere. Guys, this is once in a lifetime. This never ever happens. I hear wolves. Transylvanian wolves, Josh. I hear them. Transylvanian wolves. Now, whether they be werewolves or lichens, now that's a discussion yet to be had. I don't want to <laughs> run into it, man. Can they transform at will? Or is it a full moon only? Oh, man. You gotta get your drone, bro. You can get on the way back or after. Yeah, I was thinking that. It was good to know you, Josh. It was good. I'll treasure the memories. <laughs> it's gonna be good. This is it. <laughs> Here it is. My dragon! The door is open. Tell yourself, anything can happen here. I'm just, I'm just a Preston lad. Born in Lancashire. I was hitting up abandoned little cottages. And now, now I'm entering the doors of Dracula's castle for an overnight stay. What can I say? That's a good poem. Is, <laughs> I should write that down. This is... Alright. This is it. Looks like we are on our own. We are, yeah. No one's here. There's literally no one here. <laughs> we got a weird voice. Da -da -da -da. 
Oh, we got lands. Thank you very much. Hey, cheers. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> cheers. Cheers. <laughs> cheers. Have a good night. Yep. <laughs> cheers. All right, P, everyone. All right, P. All right, P. This is Halloween. This is Halloween. <laughs> Halloween. Oh. Cody doomed his lamp's gone out. That's it. This is the second time too. You're gonna be in blackness now. Good luck. All the lights are nearly gone out. It's only the last two down there. And that's it. Complete and utter that darkness. Sense, yeah, I'm not sure. And we have to use these for as long as possible. So guys, we have driven through the night, through days, Many days and hours have spent on the road just to get to this moment. Yeah, we might have hit a few spots along the way, but it's all been for this moment in time where we stand around a well in Dracula's castle in the pitch black with lanterns. And I gotta say, it's all thanks to you guys. And my driving, by the way, <laughs> and my <laughs> Thank driving. You, thanks to you. This is a surreal moment for me. I started doing YouTube um, not thinking anything serious. I started doing abandoned cottages and abandoned warehouses, um, and just having a bit of a laugh really. And then this happened. I'm now stood inside Dracula's castle at night in Transylvania with my boys. Yeah. And we're about to split up and head into Dracula's castle during the night. This wasn't my idea, by the way. This was Josh's, right, so if I die, this was Josh's fault because he's advised us to split up. Josh. We had to cover more ground. <laughs> <laughs> Does he, do you ever watch Dracula movies or any kind of horror movie? True, but you know what? Also, there's a tunnel system here we have to find. Okay, yeah, that's a good point, we need to find that. So we have to cover more ground. Yeah, so more find true. <laughs> Bucky, don't die on me. I don't want to explain to you, missus, that you died. Mm. Okay? Yeah. Yo, Bucky, do you have to for it? Oh, no, no don't, don't, I it before. don't let off a fart. <laughs> ever, since, ever since Josh found out about that video, he's been hysterical about it. He finds it hilarious that I forgot to cut it out. That's amazing. You guys know what I'm on about. But anyway, as we raise our lanterns, that is pretty much all we have to illuminate until they run out, and then we're in pitch black. <laughs> but we raise them to Dracula. To Dracula. <laughs> Yo, Cody, it was good meeting you while it lasted. It was fun. It was fun. Right, boys, I'll catch you in a bit. Have fun. See you later, Bucky. Don't get lost. <laughs> Try not to. Peace out, man. Peace out, Josh. <laughs> He's there. Oh, wait, this door's shut. Yeah, you gotta go there. What? Oh, yeah, that's the way. I'm lost already. This is a torture chamber. It's an Iron Maiden. A natural real Iron Maiden. It's got spikes. Imagine being in that. Right, so I'm gonna get my torch out now and again just to show things off. But look at this. So just uh, Josh and Cody have just uh, turned up down there. <laughs> We're here to see the mayor. <laughs> Dude, after that, I want to 
wait to show it off. You can go next after me. Okay. And I'll go. And then we'll go. Alright, so off we venture. So we've just seen that part of the torture chamber. And this is the second part. Oh! Oh, it's Bucky! Let me jump! Oh, it's Bucky! Let me jump! <laughs> I didn't even get you on camera then. <laughs> right, so I'm just walking down. Oh, you scared me a little bit. I thought no one, was, no one was in here. The door was shut. Just been reading about all these things here. I thought, right, I'm going to head back down now and head home. And as I walk around the corner, I scared Dan. Dan scared me <laughs> as he come through the door. It really did make me jump. The door was shut. I didn't think anyone was in here. <laughs> I didn't have the camera rolling because I thought, yeah, I'm just heading Bucky back down. him round in the dark. Oh, wow, look, look at this. All these different devices. They kind of resemble dogs. And that one resembles like a pig. Really weird. Oh, look at this thing. Oh that is that is disgusting. So this saw used to cut, used to dangle from the legs and cut down the middle of them and cut them in half with that. Holy crap. That's scary. Times like this, I'm glad I live in this age. And this device, these floorboards are creaky as hell. This device used to wrap around the neck and the seat used to slowly lower down, eventually killing them, strangling them to death. And that's a priest on there by the way. There's more devices over here I've not even seen yet. Look at that one, that one's like an elephant. Oh, another disgusting thing. So this thing used to lie on there, have the ankles strapped down there, and this would roll underneath them. Yeah. It'd roll underneath them and there'd be a piece of the head as well somewhere and they'd basically pull, pull it with this. They'd twist it round that one and go up and down just piercing the body. Oh, not to mention this thing over here for the necks. Used to grab them by the neck with them. Aren't you lucky you live in this age? As we bunch upstairs. This thing you just sit them on it. Oh my, that is gruesome. And there's a bigger one there. Oh, that's an axe used to cut the heads off with. No idea what that thing is. We've got more up here, and you think it's over. It's not. Stocks, whatever that thing is, whatever this thing is, I don't know. Oh, that's what you used to impale people on. This thing right here, Vlad the Impaler. So it looks like a, a leg brace of some sort. Needs to tighten that and it'd snap the leg in half. Who thought of these? The iron boot. Some more stocks there, original stocks. Go in your face, your throat. Butcher's knife for cutting off hands and fingers. Just more contraptions. That's shut. What's in there? What's the outside? And there's a 
torture device here. Walking down these open corridors. The sky is up there. And there, the Transylvanian Brown Village. I just can't believe I'm here. <laughs> what the hell? What is going on? Oh, it's getting windy. See some weapons on the wall. Suits of armor. We saw these during the day. That's not going to be idiots. Look, I'm just blown out. What the hell? Who is it? Josh? Cody? Bucky? That's one of you. blast please tell me someone heard heard that voice and then when I was walking through I don't know it could have been a floor was but something moved on that cabinet Oh yeah, right, so walking on this floorboard here, made that move, hold on, yeah, walking on the floorboard made that move, but I, I swear, I swear I heard a voice. And now my lantern's gone out, I'll have to put this somewhere. buy reproduction ones downstairs and I'm gonna buy quite a lot of them because I love them I think they're beautiful I swear to God, you're messing around. I swear to God, I just heard like an exhaling breath. I don't like this place now.
So, so far, I was in here today. Things seem really cool. So, things seem really good during the day. There was quite a few tourists about, but coming in here during the night, already I've experienced some weird, weird things. And I'm hoping, I'm really hoping that I got them on camera too. With how silent it was, I should have picked them up. I heard someone whisper behind me, right? And as I turned around, the, the, the candle had been blown out, it got out. It could have been me moving fast, but there's no way, because there was no spilt wax or anything, there was no wax in the candle. Also, when I was walking through this, this door over here, I heard someone go, <sighs> like exhale. No one else is around right now. They were on the other side of the castle. I am genuinely freaked out here. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to last the night. I don't even know why I agreed to this. I thought, yeah, it's gonna be cool. Halloween video, overnight, Dracula's castle. I didn't think things through. Oh, sorry, there's some cobweb things on the wall. There must be a draft and it's blowing it about. I'm really on edge right now. I don't know if you can tell. With this place being built in the 12th century, if ghosts or anything like that really, really do exist, this is the place they'll be. This holds so much residual energy inside it. All the things that's happened in this castle. How could it not be haunted? His name was Vlad Dracul II, named after his father, which also means son of the dragon, his father being Dracul of the dragon. He was of the order of the dragons. So it sounds like some out of Skyrim, but this is legit, this is history. So Vlad actually got taken away as a young boy into the Turkish army with the Ottomans of the time. So the Ottomans used to take children from Romania, Transylvania, and put them in their army, train them up, so they would fight for the Turkish. He wanted Vlad to come back to Romania and basically fight for them. Once he got here, he turned against them. A lot of things happened. You can look this up and I'll put it in the description below. A lot of things happened during this time period. Problems with the Hungarian king because he actually thought that he was gonna be fighting for the Turks. Then what happened is, there's another castle not far from here. And what he did is he got all the prisoners of war and other people, including villagers, his, his own people that were in prison, and he impaled them all on spikes and they would literally die over a day. Now he did this because he knew the Ottomans were coming to attack the castle. So when the Ottomans arrived at the castle and Vlad had already gone, he wasn't there, no one was, apart from thousands, in fact, 10,000 corpses impaled on spikes all around the castle walls. And that's where he got the name, Vlad the Impaler. There was many other stories that went along with Vlad. Dracul, and then Dracula. He used to drink the blood of his enemies. Some say he used to stalk the night, drinking his enemy's blood. So a lot of the Dracula fiction comes from Dracula, Vlad the Impaler. Most people do not believe in vampires. I mean, it's kind of crazy, right? Someone who is immortal walking around drinking blood, only comes out at night and all that kind of stuff. I'm talking about old vampire myths. But a lot of people do actually consider vampirism to be a real thing. Only last year in Malawi, there were 250 people convicted because they rioted and killed nine people believed to be vampires. They believed to these people to be going out at night sucking blood. And last year, on record, 25 people died via vampires. So you believe what you want to believe. I mean, I'm not saying vampires are real at all. And I'm not saying they're not real. Make it your own mind. Lucky. Lucky. <laughs> So I think we're going upstairs. It's getting cold. Definitely getting cold, guys. Oh wow. Nice takes us onto this roof part. Overlooking.
looking village brand. Well, I want to try and get to the top up there. Getting really cold outside. I don't even know if we're gonna last the, the night to be honest. It's locked. I know where we are. Let's go and see if we can find anyone else. So this was a secret tunnel. It's so steep and narrow. trying to find the others now for about 20, 30 minutes and I have no idea where they are. I'm starting to get a little bit worried. Oh look at this, this is part of the, uh, the actual wall foundation. What you see here, where it's built into, into the mountain itself. It was all constructed into the side of it. Absolutely amazing how they fortified this place. Oh, we found light. Let's go see if we can find everyone. Yeah, I've been looking for you guys for ages. Some weird stuff happened to me. What happened? Some weird stuff. I heard a voice from behind me when I was in in a room trying to trying to film the clock because it was so silent I could hear the ticking, and uh, there was like a voice behind me. So I, I went out of the room and, I was, and the candle blew out on its own, and I was like, "If that's any you fucking about, I'm gonna be pretty angry." <laughs> right? No one was there. And then uh, and then when I when I left the room, I heard someone behind me go, <sighs> like exhale. I think I got it all on, vi on video. What's up guys, you guys telling ghost stories? Yeah. I'm coming down right now. Come on then. So that's all the castle explored. Um, there's actually not that many rooms that I wanted to show because a lot of them are blocked off and made uh, quite touristy. But we went through all the most important rooms. For me this was one of the most surreal experiences probably of my life. I'll never forget this. Uh, Brand Castle literally shut down for the night, like all the lights off, just so we could explore this place. So big shout out to Brand Castle for that. Uh, Romania has been amazing, and we still have like, how many days have we got left? Four, four or five? Four, four or five days left yeah. in Romania, and still some absolutely amazing spots to do, including two more Dracula castles. We've got Corvin Castle. Corvin. Corvin Castle. Ponari. Ponari Castle and the forest we've got the, the forest we've got the most haunted forest yeah. in the world and um, we've got an underground cave which is like a theme park which is going to be absolutely legit and i've got to rescue the drone yet because i need to fly my drone oh, oh. i forgot about that <laughs> i've not just me i've not forgot about yes. the drone we need, to, we need to go on a drone rescue mission <laughs> soon and save <laughs> the drone 
So yeah, I'm gonna put that at the end of this video so you'll know whether we've saved the drone or not. I might just leave it a cliffhanger. I don't know, we'll see yet. No, we're getting your drone. Yeah, we'll get the drone. We've got to, we've got to get the drone. <laughs> Apart from the weird experiences I had here, I found the castle to be uh, quite chill, especially um, during the day. It was quite relaxing, but uh, definitely a different story when you turn off the lights. So yeah, make sure you subscribe and click the bell because I've still got so much amazing content to come, uh, especially before the end of uh, October. Still. Dude, there's vampires. <laughs> 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 we'll still continue with the Halloween season until the end of uh, October. Make sure you stay tuned for that. And make sure you've got the Halloween merch. Get your pictures in because I'm going to put them on the end of like most of the Halloween episodes, especially this one. You've already seen some of, uh, some of the fans wearing the merch. So make sure you check that out. And I've got the hoodie merch as well. And the website is now live. That is www.com ewfofficial.com you can get all your merchandise there so yeah thanks to the guys as well be shout out to the guys and we will see you next episode peace peace okay so when you thought it was all over it's actually not uh what the lady who's who deals with the castle has come back uh we're not actually going to be staying here overnight but this is okay we're approaching close to midnight right now so it's been like a midnight challenge and we're actually going to go in the big spire now no one no one is allowed up there I'm not, I'm talking, not even some of the staff, but they're going to take us up there right now, into the highest part of the castle. Right up there, with the, I think it looks like a bell tower, but I don't think it is. We're lost. We're lost. Oh, we're lost? Wait, sorry about the wrong one. See, everyone gets lost here. We're trying to find the door to get us up to that tower. Find out how to get there. <laughs> Big light. Big light. Okay, thank you. Ooh. So this is the way. I was trying to find out the way to the, uh, the tower. How much? Yeah. This is the part absolutely oh. no one it might be guessed oh. to see. Oh. Oh. These just drop people off. This the is the part that no one sees. This is the actual cave system. The tunnels. <coughs> Look at that, there's stairs going down. Is it? Yeah. Holy crap. How do we get down? I don't know. There could be another door. Yeah. Don't get hurt. Wow, it feels weird. Yeah. The floor bounces. Definitely it's not the same. Yeah, one at a time. Can we bags down here? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Leaving the bags down here to save weight. I'm going like up these rickety here. steps. Yeah, you're fine. You're a little bit high, bro. No, it's not bad. Because I thought it was bad. This is in the attic of Dracula's castle. Yeah, I would do it. These steps are so steep. Unless you go to this side, you look down and you can see the Wow. You need some help? No, I'm good. Please watch your steps. Wow. Well, whilst we're at the top, looking out to the city, well, the village. Do many people come up here? No. No one? No. <laughs> That's good to know. Yeah, it's amazing. Wow, oh, you can see everything from up here. But some of them go So it's an exclusive for us? Yeah. Good, that's what I like to hear. Yeah, it is exclusive for you. <laughs> right, I'm going to send Bucky up. Good luck, Bucky, because the next one coming up, he doesn't like heights. He's scared, very scared. He won't come? He's going to come up. I'm going to make him. Climb back down these. No, no, come up, Bucky. It's good. 
No, you miss out. It's, it's all roofing. Okay. Yeah, there's no drops. Yeah, yeah, it's it's down at the roof tiles. Yeah, it's getting the picture. The, 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 you, can you, my camera won't see the village, will it? It will, it's it all just, lit up. I won't see it. It's pretty well. Just get the video, the video's good. Yeah, it's just heights, that's all, isn't it, with me? Honestly, you'll be good, it's not that bad. <laughs> You've done the car cave, bro, what are you on about? Sure, actually, yeah, what about something that's different today? That's not like that building. Car cave's legit. Yeah. So I'm gonna go up and have a look. You did the first time with me, right? The first time was with me. So Bookie's first time, yeah. Oh wow. Yeah, the car cave buddy is on another level. <laughs> you think Cody should do the car cave? Leave a comment below. And a like. Yeah, and a like. Obviously, leave a like. Yeah. But yeah, head over to Cody's video as well and tell him you should do the car cave. Yeah, come tell me if I should do it or not. It's on another level. Like me and Josh, we got out of there and it felt like we'd achieved like yeah, the greatest everything. thing on the planet. It felt like we just like, I life, survived the war. Life was complete. It was. It was. I'm for, not for a good. Not yet complete. When it you was, do it, you feel complete. It was complete for a good like thirty minutes. I think. I think if we do, <laughs> I think if we rock climb down, it would. It would be not. It would be like whatever because rock climbing know. is like you go down. But dude, we had to like you just risk it all when you're going. I think down it'd be unsafe though. because like it'd the be hooks, safer. Everyone should. Yeah, but the hooks are rusty. Are there actual hooks on there? Yeah, but they're, they're like 50, 60, 80, 100, 200 years old, and they're rusty as hell. And there's like a chain on a slate ledge. And it's that, it's it's corroded, it's like little iron filings now, it's it's just completely corroded, an iron chain. Huh. So I wouldn't, I don't know if I trust. Interesting. And the thing is, is all the slate is all loose, so if you knock something into that, it could just knock the whole place down. I wonder if people down. would even still want to see it, since it's been seen so many times. Yeah, because it's always, so? it's a, yeah, because no. every time you do it, it's a different view, you know, it's a different perspective. Right. Yeah, guys, let me know if I should do it. Yeah, head over, to, it head over to Cody's, uh, go and comment on his latest video, yeah. you should go to the car cave. <laughs> Top Bucky. What do you mean? Did you get right on the roof? Yeah, it's still open. Yeah? Like, Is it good? It's okay. But... <laughs> <laughs> I just went off, had a quick scan and then went down. I weren't having any of it. That was Well, at least, that you, was at least you went off. Thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. Yeah, yeah, yeah thank you very much for that. On rescue. We are looking for the drone. I really hope we find it. Battery's missing. No way. It looks like it's all no, intact. Oh, the wings are a bit knackered. I've got spare propellers though. Oh. Hopefully the gimbal's not damaged. Right, I need to find the, the battery. You know, the battery must have bounced out. found the drone but the bad news is we can't find uh, the actual battery i'm not sure if the gimbal's damaged the propellers are seriously damaged hopefully the gimbal is still the okay the gimbal looks okay hopefully uh, dude that was lucky <laughs> that was super lucky let's well, see can't what happens we're here at night. <laughs> i know we're at brand's castle dracula's castle looking for the spare battery found the drone it's drone crazy. rescue complete little l yeah but just we're just going to buy one yeah. See what happens. Yeah. Right, so now we are leaving Dracula's castle. It's been one of the most amazing. Holy crap, what are all these? I got porcupines all over my mic. <laughs> got these all over my mic. Been one of the most amazing experiences of my life. No way in hell would I ever imagined I would be in Dracula's castle. Oh, well, not overnight, but halfway through the night. It's stupidly late and uh, we're going to go and try and find somewhere open to get some food let's look down there it's beautiful you got all the pumpkins set out the leaves are brown and golden and we just hit dracula's castle i mean what more do you want from a trip so we're just walking through the grounds of brown castle i just feel like i want to vlog because 
the emotions I'm feeling here, like any other I've experienced before, I've got to watch this, I'm walking over a bridge. It's like any other I've experienced before. I've been to a lot of places, but nothing as significant as this. This place is one of the most iconic buildings in history. Drone rescue complete. How, so how's it looking? How's it's the status? No battery. Can't find the battery. Do you have another battery? Nope. So we're gonna have to find somewhere that sells batteries. That's gonna be hard, dude. Well, we've got a hundred kilometers to drive between here. Yeah, but think about it. We're not in any city. You would have to maybe get lucky in Cor the, where the castle of Corvin is. I'll find it. <laughs> That's a tough one, bro. No, but it was literally, you know, like the top, the highest bit of the mound. It was literally just sat there perfectly. Wings out, just sat there looking like, I've been chilling, waiting for you. Like, so, where the hell you been? What's weird is I actually don't understand how the battery's missing because the battery was in the thing when it, when, when it crashed. No, it hit the tree and then it blurred out as I saw branches, so it must have fallen out hitting the branches. But how was this thing? No, because it, uh, when we looked at the live stream, it was just sitting there, but you were able to see it still, no? I could see the, 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 the way because that was it. Oh. I could see the tree. But, oh. So it's come yeah. out mid-tree mid hole. Oh. Cool. It's been bouncing through the branches. Oh, thank you so much.